Hello everyone and welcome back to another NOE 1000 tourist season session looking at our iron tower that is just in front of us, the latest monument. Still in construction, still taking a bit of time, but nevertheless lots of people are enjoying a view like none other in the center of our big town. We have lots of stuff to do. First of all, what I would like to do is I would like to, well, expand my city area a bit, right? We are rather fixed with the size of our city up to this point. We were rather fixed um, and I would like to change that now and expand my city area just a tiny bit. So over here, we still have a bit of space that I can use to make, well, the city a bit bigger. We do, of course, have the tracks here. So in that case here, I would also like to remodel my tracks there a bit because they are quite in the way I think or we just keep them there but with one change and that is some trees right next to them. I think this might work out. Let's have, um, first of all, we do need probably this marketplace here as a connection between the, um, the marketplace and the houses that we have on that side. So I'm going with another crossing just over there like this and then we can have a couple more houses in this area probably let's have the, the roads going all the way up to this point there i think we do have some yes some nature ornaments there in this corner here that i had at some point and we of course need to get rid of them and then we can just have another bunch of houses in this whole area and we definitely should be doing that as well the city is rather oh, limited and it's always fun to build more districts. Let's have that. Um, I'm going to have, let's say, two more here. The thing, though, is that I might actually, I might actually want to have some trees there or something like that. It's looking a bit, it's looking a bit too close to the trains than the tracks otherwise, right? So here in these areas, we might have some service buildings, and then we're going to that island there. This island here is already connected with the industry sector that we have um, and we can now make this um, well connection completed by also connecting this side of Crown Falls with that island here and the cool thing about that is it's actually making a lot of sense in my opinion to connect that so because for now that part of the city and the industry sector are not connected and that is rather not so realistic I think what I can also see that this is looking fantastic right now as the, the day is coming upon the city look at how beautiful it is especially with all the lighting there is still some dirt roads in here that we certainly don't want to have um let's have yep another house here i definitely do want more houses and there we might be squeezing in something yep we could squeeze in a restaurant or a cafe and on that side here that we do have the the bridge but why does it not work like that i would hmm yeah this one makes the most sense because it is the direct connection and direct extension of this road here. So I'm just going with that, the paved road, and the paved road then to this island. You know what? I don't like some of these connections here like that. Unfortunately, there's no other way of doing it. So we're going to have a one or a single track area in this in this case there. And we might also do the same thing here. Hmm. Nah, it's, it should be fine for now. But I want to have another connection with the city over here or one of the other smaller um, districts that we have so I'm going to use this whole thing there and have another connection going over to the other block perfect and then we can continue here with some normal houses those people well at least artisans they should be at the end of the game so what I definitely will need is a school in this area and the school we might just have somewhere here close to the the rivers or actually yeah that's not a good location there there we have our whole new district now on this little island. Finally, after all this time, we definitely, definitely want to have some trees, though, between the houses and the tracks. Um, the trees, and that's a pretty cool thing. This is actually not a mod right now. So this is really with the DLC, a whole new feature. I love that natural trees, right? And also another cool thing is trees are now automatically regrowing once they've been chopped down somewhere. So areas should not stay naked too long. Let's just make trees everywhere here it's just looking way more natural when you have a lot of trees of course it's not a very good thing for performance but still the city is looking much better because of that and what i also like is these new uh, jerry blossom trees that we have so definitely definitely some here close to the pub there perfect and let's build all of that the pub and all of the houses the school we already have 
and a new district has been born between <laughs> the between the waterfalls and between the railway system that we have so just here and this is going to be mostly artisans in our exquisite metropolis i could also have the same thing up here where there's a heavy traffic actually going on um, between that so there's still a bit more room of course for expansion we might be thinking about something up there as well now 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 that's for a bit of a city expansion we actually still have tasks to do let's jump right to africa and in africa we have the quest line here, the Epic of Lines, the Bronze Age. Hidden pathways, find the hidden path through the mountains on Kidusi. Um, that is still the quest here, so we still want to find out about the history, about the Bronze Age of this area. And look at the Scholar's Note of Further Information, hidden path on Kidusi. I think this is something that we could find rather easy, right? So Kidusi, there's a hidden mountain path, and we just really have to look around somewhere. And we might just be finding them something. There it is. That's looking good. Let's click on that. And that's it, I think. Or at least I the hope so. And yes, we have finished our investigation. Our and we're nearing One the end of our remains. trials. One chapter that remains that of your own tri tribulations in Anbesa. Do we get something new out of that? Come now, retrieve the Epic of the Land of Lines from Kidusi and Itoni. We have our ship These here, the Battle Cruiser, and there's the Epic of the age, Land of Lions. The Age of Lions, the Triumph of Mbesa, and we, the architects of its splendor. Alright, perhaps we need to wait a bit longer for Battle another quest to come up, because this is, after all, still nothing that I can use. And I'm pretty sure at the end of this quest we'll see an item that we can use. So while we wait on that, let's get back once again to Crown Falls. And in Crown Falls, we have something happening, and that is our Nouvelle Cuisine Entremont. And the merchly oversweet flavor of your donuts has reminded the tourist of the excellent pastries she'd been enjoying on her cruise to the city. A disturbing sharpness spreads to her smile uh, and eyes as she suggests you take her to the ship so she can procure more elaborate recipes for your restaurant. We don't really need more restaurant uh, recipes for the restaurant, I think. We have enough. Thank you. Uh, we're still going to do this, of course. Sail to the tourist mooring with, well, a majestic ship, most likely. We have something here. We have the Great Eastern, right, that we can use for that. Let's get over there. We have, by the way, lots of quests right now going on here. So the Queen is also still waiting. And also um, Tobias is having something for us, the White Shark quest that I'm not doing right now. I would rather finish those things here. So the royal reading, a trifling matter, that's still something I've been thinking about. What is that? Where do we get that? And I think we just have to deliver one book. At least one of you suggested that in the comments. A book, any book really, that seems good enough. Hi. Let's just see what we have in Crown Falls. We don't have the best books. I don't think we have really that many books anyway. We do have some parchments. Um, we do have the sheet music, Anno 27T, the map of the Lost Temple. We? Mm, we might just try a few things here, or just purchase a book. Much like the cook himself. All right, and my ship has arrived. The there we got the tourists now on board and take them to the Silver Lined Tower. Over here. The Tower Liner, all right. So there we need to transport that tourist now and off she goes on a grand journey perhaps away from crown falls there once again i didn't see much of the pleasure decks i was too busy lounging and eating in the restaurant now in africa in an in Taborum, we actually have a book that would be worth it perhaps the chronicles of mbeza an incomplete account of the mythical land of Sail Amadidus or something like that. And let's get it over there. Let's get it on our ship and get this one home. We also have the Hogarth, the harbor master. And every time passive trade happens at the trading post, there's a chance to gain five tons of coffee, gold, cotton, fabric, or chocolate. Sounds good enough. Let's also get this one right to Cape Trelawney to Crown Falls. Off you go. That's going to take a while since that is quite a distance. But there's really no other quest that we can find here. And thank you, Pirate, for the 22,000 coin. We might also be checking real quick if we not could have better relationships here with the NPCs. And we can, spot. especially also with that. Princess Ching. How could I possibly eh. 
Ah, she really doesn't like us that much. Alas, I cannot accept. Now, meanwhile, the Covenant, our Grace Eastern, is arriving here with the tourists on board. Oh, I am all a Twitter. Do you think he'll remember me? Well, anyway, shall I shan't be long. Do help yourself to the bar in the meantime. The cocktails are simply splendid. Alrighty, so she's enjoying this day now. <laughs> Sail to the Silver Tower liner to pick her up there. again. But I found, well, oh, a book of the cruise company's recipes she found. A book of the cruise and let us depart and study them in peace. Perhaps that's a book that I can actually get to the Queen. Yes, we can also now upgrade the farmers on the other side of Crown Falls to workers, so more people. This whole district now, perfect. We have after all over 5,000 tons of timber. And the book is a manuscript full of handwritten recipes and it's signed James Cook, the name of my sweetheart chef. There's something in here about a palm tree. Oh, no. Palmier. A biscuit of sorts. Interesting. And here, yes, the eclair. A special favorite of mine, especially with the chef's unique touch. Okay, so she really, really likes this guy. In the old world, I want to do something else, and that is purchase also some books here that we could use that perhaps the Queen likes. Miss Jorgensen Exemplary School to 16 proposal and Timothy's Blurry Law of Utter Depravity. They sound rather light, <laughs> so let's take them. And perhaps also um, Eli or Madame Kahina has something for us. Eli usually has only specialists, right? So no books, I think, that we could find there. Um, the pirate we can't trade with. So let's try out those books here and get them to Crown Falls. And also our tourist, the Covenant, is coming back. Our ship. Bring her back. A delightful journey all around. And let's just see what we get out of that. 50 shades of gravy. <laughs> and yes, this is most likely the book that we need for the Queen. That sounds like a very, very good quest reward so That's let's just get one of my ships actually let's get a cargo ship because they're just faster um she has something else in mind we do want a new take recipe take another wine with me she seems rather willing to make something new i don't want to have new recipes okay my workers are also coming along they all have the school trade already perfect Everything has been fulfilled, so artisans we come up with next. While the cargo ship now and the uh -huh. workers are growing and the cargo ship is on its way with the book, I have something else to do. So there's lots of stuff. Where's the book? There is the Fifty Shades of Grey. This will work. I feel confident about that to the queen. Perfect. And what we can do in the meantime is, by the way, that's a huge shadow that is now that I didn't notice before. There's actually the mountain shadow really cool i want to have a small little alpine village right so something for the hotel for the tourists up here in the mountains beside that beautiful lake because now we really do have something that makes sense up here i was thinking for quite some time and yeah a hotel or something like that with a nice little park next to it makes a lot of sense first of all once again we have some alley here or whatever you like to call that something to separate the botanical gardens from this area and over here we can then have those beautiful hotels and boy they have a view up here in the mountains so perhaps two of them might fit in nicely and of course a little bus station the bus station hmm, let's have the bus station right here or between the hotels i think this makes sense as well Let's have it between them, right? So we have one hotel. Is this what we are yes, to be and she actually accepts day? the book. How perfect is that? Let's build our first hotel here. Right, the shadow is going away now. As we can see. And then we have the bus station in the middle between them. And then I'm going to have another hotel up here. Right, so two of them 
in the mountains with the beautiful view that we have there of course there's still some surroundings that we have to do here for example i definitely would like to have a lookout point up here so people can actually watch that beautiful view of the the lake something that we could have then here in this area and then a lookout point up here at the end of the whole thing right some kiosk perhaps where people can purchase something just some smaller things a little sign that tells you you are now at the lake and perhaps a little map for hikers if they want to hike something and of course a dirt road that goes then into the the woods here far away from everything yes and also hmm, we might have a restaurant here after all a restaurant by the botanical garden at the end that actually makes sense i mean it doesn't make sense from a point of view where we say um we want to attract a lot of people around it for the bonuses but it makes a lot of sense if we want to have a restaurant just for the view or a coffee shop let's make a cafe right by the lake a fire broke out something out here where people can enjoy their day there we have then the buses they just get a few um let's say up from the maps and, and, and perhaps see. also a few trees here that we could use there and also some kiosks where people can purchase something oh wait a second that's not a kiosk it's a pavilion we do want to have something like a postcard vendor out here and a souvenir shop oh souvenir shop is a bit bigger yes the souvenir shop we can actually make here work let's have the souvenir shop in this area and then a pavilion at the end of that whole thing. Perfect. Let's build it. Hotels. The ornaments. The bus. The cafe. And all of these ornaments. And oh yeah, the cafe. Hmm. Would need another bus station. That's fine. We can squeeze in the bus station. Right next to this area so people can travel directly to this area there fine we might still be having a few more ornaments in the area Is this what we are supposed oh to read and yes about the day? book i was forgetting about that Is this what we are supposed to oh excellent choice adventure glory and most importantly romance i shall no doubt dream of my love to be tucked love to be away tucked away in a distant court, court. that's what the queen wants to hear wants to read Your ship has we still keep the book that's oh no we do get the 100 oh, 18 110 knights <laughs> that we get for the book choose someone to be the, the queen's maid in. servant what is going on here what do we need to do there that we do have a few people now at the yeah at the iron tower and someone should be her maid servant is there something deeper behind that talk to the potential mates on your island agreeing to hire the maid will finalize your choice Oh, no, 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 she looks way too ser serious. Um, we might have someone over here. It would be a great and humbling she looks desperate. Do we have someone else? Or is it only those two? Ah, over there is still another one. I never said, but... The Queen's maid? My goodness! I can't wait to see my stupid friend's jealous faces! Oh, that's a hard choice. You know what? Let's make the poor girl her maidservant that probably humbles the queen <laughs> and we're doing well, something good here let us review invitations sir archibald will provide accommodation staff the reception she seems eager to please confident and discreet and we do get a white peacock a legendary a item for the zoo and we actually still need some zoo items perfect that is something we can use right away and let's also just finish this whole block here with the artisans and there is now a banquet to be held but i think we can now start with the iron tower the world will remember this day let your hood commemorate that the trifle tower of pastry okay the tower of pastry that's not exactly what i how i would call it 
All right, the queen is rather anxious that there might be something bad happening to the Iron Tower or the inauguration, so we do need to have a police station close by. As if space wouldn't be a problem already. Um, hmm, let's just see. We do have a police station close near the Iron Tower. How should we do that? We could have it here behind the hotel, but I would have to get rid of this little ornamental area there. Mm, there we have the bus. I could get rid of the bus. Yes. Let's get rid of the bus for now. Um, just for that quest. Your unblinking red -eyed and the price of glory. To sweep your city of so there is actually something happening here. And with inauguration day drawing ever nearer, so Archibald has started to worry that security is not up to snuff. He insists that there need to be more police patrols near the monument. And we need to find conspirators. They look like they belong to a jail. Why anyone would disturb such a day of importance? The farmers. The queen. I've got nothing against her. Of course, they are not saying anything else. And... There is still someone else over there. The gang of workers. That's the ones. That's the usurpers. The workers are always the usurpers. And... I guess we need to make a decision now. Alright, the workers after all are of course the usurpers and he is resistant, so threaten to increase taxation or we could corrupt him. 10,000 coin? I look, me little one's sick and alright, I'll do it. Perfect. The queen must be saved at all costs. And find the group of workers near the harbor. The ones that are attempting to kill the queen. Now which harbor are we talking about? We do have a couple of harbors. And I guess they might be here in this area. We have three harbors actually, so it has to be one of them. There they are. <laughs> Probably with bombs in the, on the back. Help us out, will you, boss? And collect them at your harbor, from the harbor. Where should we send them? To Eli? Collect the conspirators in your harbor. Of course, with a battleship. Nothing else would do. Now, the ship is on its way to Archie. Of course, we can do something in the meantime. We do need to do two things, actually. Um, and that is, first of all, the sugar. We do need some sugar now for our recipes that we have at the restaurant and the coffee shops. And we also need to reinforce the pearls. Pearls is something that is really low, and without pearls, we cannot get jewelry in. And jewelry is really low at this point. Um, pearls is the important thing here. So let's go to the new world. There's actually both things that we can do over there. Um, one of them is the sugar, and that is over here with the oh rum. So there's the sugar cane. And we can now have over here the chocolate and there is the sugar refinery we only need that really here and that's producing every 30 seconds we have 19 sugarcane plantations on the island and we do have 24 rum distilleries so we're using more rum distilleries i get i take it that we are boosting them yes 50 percent that is fine what we can see though is that the sugarcane is actually Full, so it's perfectly fine if we have a few more of them since we're boosting them anyway um, And let's say four of those sugar refineries for now. They however cost me 50 obreros We have enough of that. Let's just have the sugar refineries over. Ah, no, that's a bad spot Actually, that's a very good spot here um, because a farm wouldn't make that much sense in this area that we can have another warehouse and then let's just have those four sugar refineries um, right here and they all have a nice connection right to the warehouse producing us now the sugar that we need hmm, I might actually make a fifth one just that it matters really um, and then what we could compensate for that is we could just have uh, nope not here but I could just have another yeah let's have another one here In the area that's important 
right? And they're working at 150% efficiency. So that's pretty fine for us, mighty fine. Over here, we also have a bit more space. There's actually the oil fields that I wanted to keep or that I wanted to use at some point. Hmm. There we still have a bit of space. Let's use that. That's looking good So now, for now. What we need for that, once again, is, of course, another trade route. And we do have a trade route already going to Plyer... No, Maribu we are, right? We are at Maribu. And we do have a problem with our Obreros. I hope it stays like this. The Bombins are running out. Of course, I could use that and I could probably still I'm upgrade. Yes, we can still upgrade a few more houses. Right, to get the Obreros in. And then I might just have a few more normal houses in the area to get the Honoleros back up. And in Rio Grande, we actually have something else, and that is the pearls production or the pearls farms. We have already quite a, a lot of pearls up here. This beach here still has a bit of space, though, that we could use most likely for more pearls. Um, there's the harbor area. Let's just have a looky at how many pearls we would actually need. By the way, we have a lot of buildings available in the new world now too. In this beautiful area there. And I might just need the pearls. Also, while we're looking for the workforce, my ship has returned and is now on its way to Archie, where we can finally deliver the prisoners. Stay tuned. <laughs> 